the only thing that anyone is talking about at all nowadays is Retro Bowl QB mode. And some of you have been wondering, when am I going to play Retro Bowl QB mode? The answer is never. Today, I have something even better. Today, I have Retro Bowl career mode. What's going on guys, Hostile Beast here, and today, I'm going to be trying out Retro Bowl career mode for you all. So as you can see, we are going to play as a player in this mode. We get to choose our position. I'm going to play as QB, of course, because that's the most fun. But in theory, you could play as a receiver or running back or defensive back, whatever you wanted to do. You may notice it says high school. We are not starting as a pro. We are not starting in college. We are starting all the way back in freshman year. So we get to pick our high school. We get to pick our state first. So there's some pretty good ones here. But the one that jumped out to me most is Texas because Texas is kind of like the big state for high school football. So I think we're gonna go with Texas. And then we get to pick our school. I don't live in Texas. I have no clue what any of these schools are, or how good they are. I think I'm going to go with North Shore though because that sounds the most fun to me. Welcome to Retro Bowl Career Mode. We start our freshman year as a quarterback on a high school football team. And so here we are. We are ranked number 25th in the state. So pretty good actually, but there's always room for improvement, all right? We gotta get to number one. And we got some new tabs here. So at the bottom, we got personal. So here's our grades. We got our four subjects and our relationship with our head coach. So this is kind of interesting. And then there's GPA at the bottom. What does this do? Our GPA determines our academic eligibility to play in football games. A GPA below 1.8 would register you ineligible to play an upcoming game. So we have to like keep our grades up if we want to play. That's actually pretty realistic. What is our GPA? 2.0, 2.0, this kid is stupid. How you have a 2.0 GPA? Throw mine up on screen, all right? Editing HP, put my GPA up on screen. That's unweighted too, all right? Your boy HB been hitting the books. What other stuff we got here? We got relations. Okay, so we can like add stuff. I think we can add like friends and stuff on there too. So head coach and friends and then shop. We can also get a job. You have to be a sophomore to get a job though because we can't drive yet because we're still a freshman in high school. So can't get a job just yet. And at some point we'll be able to shop too once we get our job. If you want to see how I did this, how I got Retro Bowl Career Mode, Make sure to watch till the end of the video because I will explain everything. So now I guess we gotta do this first. We're gonna hit continue. You will now have the opportunity to try out. We have to try out for our team. Okay, so what happens if we suck? Do we get cut? Performance here impacts playing time as well as the coach's knowledge of your skills. Oh my gosh, this is actually a lot of stuff. So first up, passing. All right, we are a QB, so we gotta pass first. Um, I know how to do this, but we just gotta make sure we do this right. So he's gonna run his route. Why did you stop? Now we're gonna drop back. All right, this is just pretty basic QB stuff. Run your route. Why, 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 why'd why you stop running? I'm really hoping the coaches do not count that against me because he he did not run his route properly. Gotta get some better receivers here. Well, come on. Run your route. Run your route to his... Why did you stop again? Okay, we gotta just like throw it to him right there. There we go, there we go. Easy completion, all right? He had to run a little bit outside of his route, but I'm sure it's gonna be fine. Now we gotta rush. Okay, so we're practicing for like scrambling. Oh, okay, that, uh, that, that was first attempt at rushing. We're gonna run by, how? Rush again, please, please get around it. There we go, there we go. We got around this one. Got, no, oh my gosh. I better pray the coaches are not looking at this, right? This is an embarrassment to football people everywhere. There we go. So we got our little rushing thing. That's like the fifth try though. Now we gotta run as a QB. We just do a little scramble, you know, and then, okay, you have to dive. Hope my form is good on that dive. We have to kick. I'm not a kicker. I literally did so bad they're gonna demote me to kicker. I'm actually good too. Look at that. Your coaches determined that your tryout was not successful enough to warrant a starting job. However, since no one else tried out for the quarterback position, you've been named the starter. So we were super bad. I, I mean, that was expected though. We, we had an awful tryout, but no one else wanted to be quarterback. So now we get to play. We have our first game of the season at Georgetown. All right. So they are number eight in the state. We are number 25. And looking at these rankings, I don't know how we're number 25. We got a two-star defense, man. Come on. And two and a half-star offense, that's not much better. They have a five-star offense and a four and a half-star defense. We are supposed to lose this game. Everyone has written us off. You know, they say North Shore, they're not going to win anything. They have that dumb freshman QB. But you know what? No, we're going to go out there. We're going to win this game. This is a statement game. We got to play today. We have the ball first. And my first play as QB of North Shore, we're taking our shot. I don't care what my coaches say. We're not handing it off. We're taking a shot. And he's got the catch. That was a phenomenal catch, but it was a good throw too. So hopefully they take notice of that. Now we're going to hand it off because it's not a high school football game without a two yard rush. You know what else this high school football game needs? A QB draw. A QB draw for let's say like five or six yards. No, Lamar Jr. over here getting seven yards. Hand it off again. Gotta have a nice balance of run and pass, you know, probably like 75% run, 25% pass. We got Smith on the little comeback route right here. We're about to get sacked, but he gets it away and Smith has eight yards. Could not get away from that defender though. Tight end right here. Tight end, tight end. Oh, overthrown. He is slow. My man needs to get back on the offensive line, all right? Smith is fast though. Look at Smith go. Oh, he's running around that defense to the middle of the field. He's got the catch. 
Smith is quickly becoming my number one favorite target. We hand it off to Jones right here, and Jones has a good rush for 11 yards. I think I'm gonna run right here. No, they're sending the blitz. Someone is open. He dropped it. He dropped the touchdown. Quick pass to Davis to run around to the edge, and he gets the corner for the touchdown. Making up for that drop is Davis, and now our kicker does not make the extra point. He hits the upright. There's Georgetown's ball. We lead 6-0. to zero. Come on, defense. Let's see what you can do. Pope was not strong enough. They're in the red zone. Pope wasn't strong enough again, and it looks like they're gonna score. They make their extra point, and we are down 7-6. to six. Minute 22 left in this half. We gotta drive down there and score. Our offense looked pretty good, except for the kicking. So if we can just do the same thing again, look at this. Look at Jones get six yards, almost broke free for a huge gain. Give it to him again. The coaches love this man, right? He is their star senior. Jones is like the stud of the team and they're gonna hand it off to him a lot. But now we have our chance to throw it the slant route and Davis dives for it. Davis messed up earlier, he dropped a touchdown, but you know what, I will say, I do respect him getting back on it and doing his best to make plays. And look at that, Jones got stopped. Now it's third and one, 46 left in the half I think we're gonna run this one yes we are we gotta scramble and look at him go five yards he gets hit at the end of that play it's fine though right in high school they just bounce there's no injuries in high school clock winding down though we take a shot to Davis they're not gonna be expecting it Davis has got the catch on the six we use our one audible it that was a mistake that was bad I think we're gonna hand it off right here get a little closer no we get one yard we call a timeout second down 11 seconds to go hitch right up here for James no we gotta scramble seven six five four touchdown and now we go for two to put us up 14 to 12. There is no play right here. See what opens up, see what opens up. Gotta scramble, get to the corner. And he's got the two points as well. H Beast is fast on his feet. It's 14 to seven at the end of the first half. Georgetown ball, let's see what the defense can do here. Davis missed the tackle. There's, there's a Davis on both sides of the ball, it seems. They're probably siblings. Pope was not strong enough and they're gonna score. Their extra point is good, and it's a tie game. Smith on the post route. He is my favorite target on this team. I love throwing to Smith. He takes us across midfield and more. Smith for 31 yards. Great run after catch right there. And now we're gonna hand it off. Come on, Jones, do something. He gets seven yards. All right, that's his best rush of the season, I feel like. Now we got Smith. No, we do not have Smith. We got a pressure, and we're taken down for a loss of five. Second and 15, we got a pass right here, don't we? Yes, we do. No, no one is open. We gotta run. I'm not throwing an interception. Get out of bounds. Okay, we have nine yards. Third and six. Smith cutting down inside. Smith over the middle. Converts. 17 yards. Takes us down to the three. And that will end the third quarter. Two and a half yards out. Hand it off. All the way down to the one yard line. This is not the NFL. This is not college. This is high school. So you know what we have to do. We have to punch it in for the touchdown. I want the passing touchdown, all right, but they wanted to give the running back one too. I, I respect it. He deserves one, he's playing all right. Let's see if our kicker can actually make it this time, and it's up. It's good. We lead 21 to 14, minute and a half left to go in the fourth quarter. Georgetown drives downfield. Come on, defense, make a stop. Defense cannot do anything, and they're gonna score. They missed their extra point, and it's 20 to 21. All we have to do is get a first down here, and the game is over. Quickly run, and they read that play, a loss of one. Hand it off right here. Get through, yes! Keep going, stay in balance, run the clock, 13 yards. And this game is so close. Jimmy, come back. Jimmy, come on. We're starting to get close to the win here, please. Yes, Davis for 16. Smith down below. They're losing their breath. He hauls it in for 14. And this game is almost over. 11 seconds left. A touchdown here to seal it. And we get it! Extra point is good. And we're gonna knock off Georgetown. 28 to 20, we pull off the upset. There we go. You only have time to do one of these things this weekend. What the heck? You can either study or watch film. We're the best player on the team. I don't need to watch any film, okay? I'm gonna study. We also need to improve upon that 2.0 GPA. That is an embarrassment. So there we go. We start out 1-0 on the season. Let me know if you guys enjoyed this video. Sadly, this is not a mode you can play yourself, all right? I edit all of this. This is just like overlays and stuff. So this is just my concept as to what a career mode would look like in Retro Bowl. So sadly, you cannot play it at this time. But if you like this and you wanna see more like this, let me know in the comments. Let me know. Part two or no part two. Tell me what you think. Tell me what your favorite part of the video was. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.